Hi. So you are applying for a job of a nanny or a babysitter and you are wondering how will I go about the safety measures of a child in the house. In this video, I'm going to be sharing with you some of the tips and hacks that you are going to use as a babysitter, especially when you are taking care of little children because their safety is very important to the people that you are working with. So if you are new to my channel, welcome. I'm Shafi or I'm Phoebe from Takenya Lifestyle and in this video I'll be sharing more about the baby safety. A disclaimer, I'm not advisor or a professional advisor regarding the children. This video is just meant for entertainment upon my own personal experience. So welcome. First and foremost is actually to keep off the children from machines, especially the laundry machines, the cooking machines, and everything that has to do with the cleaning machines or anything. Just keep them off because babies love to actually insert stuff in the laundry machine or they can even go inside the laundry machine and it can actually cause a big problem to you. So try to make sure that the machine is off. <laughs> Number two, don't allow the child to go inside the toilet or inside the laundry room and don't allow him or her actually to use the detergent that you are using. Make sure that you are removing or you are putting away everything concerning the detergents, concerning the, the washing or cleaning stuff away from the child because Kids love to play with everything, so they're going to mess up. They're going to want to play with such stuff. And it can be a problem, especially the ones that you are using that are actually um, harmful to the skin. So put off or keep away from the child so that the child cannot be harmed using such things. Number three. Always clean the fruits that the baby want or always try to make sure that they are clean. And regarding the food, before you give the child any fruit or any food, make sure that you are washing them and also washing the child's hand. Because little kids love to touch everything and sometimes they can touch dust, which is harmful to their health. So make sure that they are clean, they, they are clean their hands are clean each and every time just take a look at their hands and clean them even when they are clean just make sure that you are cleaning and you are sanitizing the child's hands all the time when you are in the kitchen and you are trying to make something or you are cooking try to make sure that the child is not near your cooking or your cooking items or equipments and also try to make sure that you do not let the child touch anything that you are using especially when you are cooking because he or she can burn herself or she can injure herself so try to avoid such instances Number five, try to make sure that you are checking everything that the baby is playing with, especially the toys. Uh, don't allow the baby to use harmful toys or something that can injure the baby. So try to give him, him or her the best one or the good one that she or he loves and uh, just keep an eye on the child's toys wherever you are with her or with him so give him the best one that he loves or the best one that cannot harm him the ones that are not sharp the ones that do not actually enter or make or can cause anything on the child's health so try to avoid things that are very sharp try to avoid uh, toys that are actually smaller or little because some of them they can actually cause injury so such things like glasses such things like batteries like such things like coins like uh, actually toothpick like medicine or even the glasses that the baby can use to actually use to drink water try to keep away uh, from the child because these ones if the glass falls down it can injure the child and you can be in trouble and the baby can actually get harmed so always try to make sure that the toys that the child is using they are well and um, the, you supervise everything that the child is using okay 
Number seven, try to make sure that you are keeping off the child from the sockets or the electricity items or any cable that the child can get. Remember the child loves such things or he or she going to play with them. And this can be very dangerous, very, very dangerous. So try not to give him or take him close to items that concerning electricity. Always keep an eye on the child. Number eight, if you are dealing with an infant or a small baby, make sure that the baby's nails are cut like uh, they are very neatly cut and also use the right machine to cut the baby's nails so that she or he cannot scratch herself and cause harm. Keep an eye on where the baby is and especially if you have edges like tables, chairs that can cause harm to the child, make sure that you tell the owner to put safety measures because such things can cause injury to the child because when the child is moving around, he or she can actually hurt herself or himself. Another thing is don't give the baby hot food and also when you are preparing the baby's food, make sure that you are using the right ingredients according to the parent's description or according to the, owner's, the owner of the house description. So give the child the food that is actually warm, not cold and not so hot. Make sure that the food that you are giving the baby is actually not too big and uh, because it can actually cause a uh, choking the child can actually take big or bite big items or pieces and it can cause trouble so make sure that they are not big uh, another thing is that uh, you should always use the right items or equipment for the baby uh, for instance, when you want to actually clean the baby's butt, um, make sure that you are using the right item or the right equipment. Another thing regarding bathroom and uh, the baby, it is that don't leave the baby alone in the bathroom, not even for one second, because this can cause a lot of problems. The baby can actually drown in the water that you are using or something can go wrong. So please be sure to keep an eye and never leave an a child especially a young child in the bathroom alone another thing is that make sure that you are giving the baby the food and don't eat the baby's food i have seen a lot of new nannies or a lot of uh, babysitters who actually eat everything for the baby and when the baby wants to eat there's nothing for the baby give the baby the food let him play with the food like when you are supervising him or her and make sure that he actually is not using the wrong items so be careful when the baby has the food so last but not least make sure that whenever the baby is asleep try to check the baby after every 15 minutes just to make sure that the child is okay and that the child has not actually covered herself or him now I have to say that if you are a Kenyan lady, for my Kenyan ladies, and you are looking for a babysitting job or a nanny job in Turkey, I have some opportunities for you. Just DM me or actually private message me on Takenya, at Takenya, on my Instagram. Write to me at my uh, Instagram at Takenya. I'll be sharing more information about the opportunities here in Turkey regarding babysitting jobs. Otherwise, for now, bye bye.